Hi everybody, welcome to GT Coding. This is a custom select box that I had created. And in the previous video, I also showed you how to get the values from this uh, custom select box and uh, display it on a different page using PHP. So if you want to watch those videos, I will leave the link in the description below. Now this is a really short video where I will just show you how to remove this search functionality from this custom select box. So let's get started. Now this is the source code of our custom select box. You can find the source code in the description below. Alright, so the first thing you need to do is remove the input tag for the search. So here we can see this is the input tag which we are using for searching. So just remove the division altogether and we'll do the same with the second select box as well. Alright, once you're done with that, we'll go to the main.js file and here also we have some instances of the search so the first thing to do is search for search box so i'll just press ctrl f and here we will type search box and remove wherever you find the search box so remove it from here and uh, remove it from here and we'll also remove this from here and also remove this event listener now this function over here called filter list is for searching the options inside our custom select box. So we can delete this function as well. So just delete it and also delete the line of code where we are calling the function. All right, now let's go to our design and see how it works. And we can see our search box is not being displayed. And uh, the last thing we need to do is uh, we need to remove the top margin from here. So let's go to our style.css file and we'll go to options container. So here we can see options container active. Now we'll set the top margin to 54. And let's refresh our page. And now we can see that the search box is gone and uh, everything looks all right. So this is basically how you remove the search functionality from our custom select box. Alright, so that's it for this video. I hope that you found this useful and if you have any doubts, you can ask in the comments below. And if you like this video, please click on the like button and subscribe to this channel to get the latest video updates. Thanks a lot for watching. Have a nice day.